Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2019 730D M Sport. Vehicle comes hugely packed with some fantastic features and options. It's presented in the Donington Grey. We're going to begin with showing you one of the amazing features. We've all been there, we've parked miles away from anybody else in the supermarket car park, but someone has parked far too close to you. This is one of the features with the remote control parking. So we can bring the car forward, first of all, as you can see in a minute using the remote control key there we go so there is no one as you can see in the driver's seat that is just purely using the remote control key and we can also reverse the car as well really handy bit of kit using the display key so as you can see there is nobody in the car it's just purely using the remote key it's a fantastic bit of kit and can get you out of those tight parking spaces it does save you opening the door and potentially giving yourself a car park ding Thank you very much for that. So we'll now finish off by going around and showing you all of the huge, huge features and options on this wonderful 730D then. So at the front, we've got the LED headlights. This is of course a facelift 7 series, so it's a much sharper looking car in my opinion. Four 360 view cameras in those very, very impressive front grills. 20 inch M Sport alloy wheels. They look fantastic on this car. They're all in immaculate condition. Bridgestone Batenza tires. The Donington Grey, in my opinion, is a really nice colour for the 7 Series. It's a very, very subtle colour. And we will go through then and show you a bit more about this car inside then, because of course the 7 Series is definitely more focused on the inside. This is the display key. So as you can see, you can flick through different menus. You can set departure time so it can turn the heated seats on heating the massage seats for the rear passengers as well as quite a few other features including showing you where the vehicle is parked the leather itself is the ultra soft moreno leather quilted of course it looks absolutely incredible set against the exterior finish it's got the harman kardon audio and there are speakers all the way around this car i think there's a total of 18 speakers in this vehicle so well and truly it's going to pack a punch in terms of the audio system one unique feature about this 7 series as opposed to all of the other luxury saloon cars is the fact that bmw have kept their 50 50 weight distribution motto in mind with the carbon core so yes it's a very very hugely packed vehicle but of course it still can make a move should it want to it's still a very good handling car we've got the rear tv entertainment package in the back there i'll go around the other side and show you more of that in a moment rear massage seats just here as you can see and again i'll show you more of that in a moment the center armrest can be raised so it is a full three seat isofix rear bench but that is of course where all of the controls are for the rear electric seats if i just scooch down here a little bit we can show you those in action Going to adjust things even like the headrests electrically let's turn this tv screen on this is going to be a bit of a longer video because i'm sure you can appreciate just how much technology is in here go to media tv it's full digital tv as well so you've got things as you can see on here if we click into let's say i don't know uh, bbc2 god knows what's going to be on at this time as you can see bbc2 is now playing and we'll go round to the other side in a moment there we go we've got bbc2 on now bbc news so of course that will work whilst you're driving there's individual headphone slots for the rear passengers you can of course also use the bluetooth headphones as well connect those up keep everybody happy including front passengers so you can have the radio playing whilst rear passengers have their entertainment huge boot space in the 7 series of course that's also electric closing and opening much prefer the sharper three-dimensional lights on this newer facelift shape again there are those wonderful 20 inch alloy wheels it does sit on the new four-way air suspension si setup which again does provide better comfort and of course much better handling in my opinion it's the by far the best air su system air suspension system out there beautiful ambient lighting all the way around this interior looks absolutely fantastic no matter how you have it set up i've got it in blue but of course you've got a wide array of colors to choose from it has got the soft closed door so if we don't quite shut the door properly like so that'll take care of itself as you can see there comfort access as well but of course you can unlock everything using the display key as we've tried to show you also displaying that lovely parking feature so inside the driver's side then start it up the steering wheel moves electrically is also heated we've got this lovely 
colour touchscreen system for all of the climate settings. The front seats are heated. We've got a heads up display. Wireless charging tray just down here. Ideal for charging the display key. Pop that in there. That'll start to charge up nice and simple. Again, another nice feature in here is everything is laid out exactly where you would anticipate it to be. Even the climate settings are touchscreen, as you can see, so I can scroll around, turn everything down or turn everything up. Back onto more of the, let's say, standard features then. This is again all touchscreen, as you can see. If we swipe across here, these are customizable, so you can set these widgets to something of your own preference. However, if you're not a fan of touchscreen, fear not, BMW, don't take away your iDrive scroll wheel. I really commend them for that because a lot of people are not happy with touchscreen technology and I can't blame them because it doesn't always work in a lot of other cars. The BMW one is really, really good, I have to say. Vehicle status, service requirements. As you can see, it's recently had a service at 10,000 miles. It's not due on for 6,000 miles. The current mileage is just over 17,000 miles. So we're sorted for servicing information. I'm trying to get through as much as possible for you now. In terms of devices, then we can connect using regular Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. So that's every base sorted. Wide array of multimedia inputs, DAB, you've seen the TVs. We can also have TV up front, of course, only when the handbrake is applied. Again, let's go on BBC2. That will now start to play up here. Back out from that and let's click into reverse and show you some of the cameras. So at the moment, let's fold the mirrors back out. And then we can have full 360 view, rear camera, front camera, or of course 3D view as well. So like I say, this 7 Series is absolutely packed full of some of the best technology that is available on the current market cars. It's got some really useful features as well as some very innovative ones like that parking feature where you can control it using the remote control key. Really, really useful. Like I say, we've all been there. You've parked miles away from anybody else in the supermarket car park. You come back and somebody has parked slap bang next to you. It's not gonna be a problem for you here. Fire up your remote control parking, pull the car forward or pull it backwards and you can climb on back into the car with ease. It's a lovely, lovely prime example of a 730D M Sport. For any further information regarding prices, funding options, and a little full write-up on the car, if you see below in the description, there'll be a link to our website. You can also give us a call directly. For now though, thank you very much for watching this quite a longer video. But of course, with a 7 Series, you do need to try and get as much in as possible. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.